Palm oil is a vegetable oil that is extracted from the fruit of the oil palm tree. It is a major source of cooking oil in many parts of the world, and is also used in a variety of other products, such as margarine, cosmetics, and biodiesel. One of the ways that palm oil is processed is through hydrogenation. Hydrogenation is a chemical reaction that adds hydrogen atoms to the oil, making it more saturated and solid. This process has a number of advantages, including increasing the shelf life of the oil, making it more stable at high temperatures, and improving its texture. The hydrogenation process for palm oil takes place in a series of steps. First, the oil is heated to a high temperature, typically between 180 and 220 degrees Celsius. This helps to break down the double bonds in the oil, making it more receptive to hydrogenation. Next, a catalyst is added to the oil. The most common catalyst used for hydrogenation is nickel, but other metals, such as palladium and platinum, can also be used. The catalyst helps to speed up the hydrogenation reaction. Finally, hydrogen gas is added to the oil. The hydrogen gas reacts with the double bonds in the oil, adding hydrogen atoms and making the oil more saturated. The hydrogenation reaction is exothermic, meaning that it releases heat. This heat is typically removed from the system to maintain a constant temperature. The hydrogenation process can take anywhere from a few minutes to several hours, depending on the desired level of saturation. Once the hydrogenation process is complete, the oil is filtered to remove the catalyst and any other impurities. The hydrogenation process for palm oil has a number of advantages. First, it increases the shelf life of the oil, making it more stable at high temperatures. This is important for products that are used for cooking or frying. Second, hydrogenation improves the texture of the oil, making it more solid and easier to spread. This makes it a good choice for products such as margarine and shortening. However, the hydrogenation process also has some disadvantages. One disadvantage is that it can produce trans fatty acids. Trans fatty acids are not considered to be healthy, and they have been linked to a number of health problems, including heart disease and stroke. Another disadvantage of hydrogenation is that it can reduce the nutritional value of the oil. Some of the nutrients in the oil, such as vitamin E, can be destroyed during the hydrogenation process. The hydrogenation process for palm oil is a complex process that has both advantages and disadvantages. It is important to weigh the pros and cons of hydrogenation before deciding whether or not to use it in a particular product. Thank you for watching this video about the hydrogenation process for palm oil. I hope you found this information helpful.